Hey guys and welcome to my channel. Just a little short video blog I want to start doing on my little journey to learning how to do tissue culture. It's something that's fascinated me for years and, and I'd love to start doing it for carnivorous plants, producing them, watching them little, little plants grow and then even if I can sell them then in the future it'll be quite fun as well and, and pay for the hobby so let me show you this little grow box i've been building as you can see in the in the photo i've fixed my lights up i've i've got it all nearly there and then i decided to install some fans i've got loads of these little computer fans lying around if i ever see a computer at the bin i, I can't resist but take it apart get the fans out and any other little electronics that i feel i might be able to use even though i ain't got much idea about electronics so i got the fans I've um, been looking on how I can fix them all up and take a look this is where I am so far so I've got this uh, set up here just as a, an experiment just to see how it all works before I plug up the locked in inside my grow box and this is the cheap little thermostat I got from eBay four euros including shipping they come from China but it works brilliantly you know and there's a lot of help how to plug it up on internet and on YouTube so I'd really recommend this. This is the little temperature um, measuring, whatever they call it, gizmo. And uh, I've got it set up at 25 now. Just see what happens when it reaches 25. If you just watch the fan. Awesome, eh? Works beautifully. And I've just set, the, you, you can program this. It's got a lot of settings. You can also calibrate the temperature if it's off a little bit. But I've got it set up so that once it drops down one degree from 25, so as soon as it gets to 24, it's 24.7 now. As soon as it hits 24, it'll automatically just cut that fan off. I'm super excited about this little setup. It, it kind of just developed. I was just going to have the fans running all day long. And, and I found this, um, I had lying around the house. Look, it's just turned it off automatically now. And... Um, I had this lying around in my electrical box as well and I couldn't run about 10, 10 or 12 fans someone told me with this so for it to run 3 or 4 fans it's not going to be a problem. I'll show you more about that in a, in a minute. So this is what I'm using to power my fans. I just had this lying around in my big electrical box where I store everything. I, I don't like throwing stuff away and it's a bit of a problem I suppose but um it's come in handy after having it probably and carrying it with me to different houses for the last six years but um it's exactly the voltage i needed it's 12 volts and my fans are 12 volts the mobile phone charges it was suggested on a forum that you can use them as well but i wanted to use this i thought i can run quite a lot of fans with this look it's 20 watt max you know i mean i can can run loads of them fans with this little power pack and um originally i was just going to run the fan on its own uh, but then the thermostat idea sounded fantastic and when i saw that for four euros i mean i couldn't resist it you know i thought it's well worth checking it out so that's where we are i'll get back to you with another blog once i've got all these installed and 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 it'll be interesting to see um i'll be looking forward to making my first load of cultures Hey guys, thanks for watching. Hit that like button and subscribe. I'm going to be making some little video blogs on my journey towards doing tissue culture. And when I'm doing other things with plants and that, if I feel like I can make a video from it, uh, I will do. So I, I'm not promising any schedules for video posting. It'll be here, there and everywhere. So, but thanks guys. See you later.